Today we are making Mexican nachos Indian style. The ingredients we need are chips, tortilla chips or like any kind of corn chips, and then refried beans, multicolored bell peppers, cilantro, salsa, onion, cheese, olives, and some sour cream that you need to whip a little bit to get that fluffiness. For refried beans, you can use canned refried beans or you can take black beans and red beans and soak them in water for six hours. Then in a pressure cooker, uh, make them two whistles and boil them in there. Then crush them in the mixer. Take a pan and add one small spoon of oil and then add some hink. Then also add a small spoon of garlic paste. Add a small spoon of green chili paste and ginger paste and saute for two minutes. Add your crushed beans. Then add a small spoon of red chili powder also add some coriander and cumin powder. Then add salt to taste. Add puree from one tomato. Add some water to get the perfect consistency. Now our refried beans are ready. So you could crack the chips a little bit and first we're going to be adding the refried beans spoon by spoon. This is all going to be in layers. Next we're going to add the multicolored bell peppers. You can add any color and they all basically taste the same. And then we're gonna add some onion. You can chop them in as big pieces as you want to. Chop them a little smaller, not too big. Then add your olives. You could add olives if you want to, to give it that taste of, like, of olives. And then add your salsa. You could add homemade or store-bought salsa. You don't need to add too much. Also, like, don't add a lot, a lot. Then it will make the chips like a little squished. Next, add your cheese or sour cream. You. Probably you should add the cheese um, after the sour cream so it can give that topping little thing. And then add some cilantro to give that topping vibe. You could also add some spring green onion to give it a good taste. So here it is our Mexican nachos Indian style. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below. Hope you enjoyed this recipe. Comment down below if you did try it. And yeah, we will see you with a new video very soon. Bye!